We are here inside Galatoire. This is a sacred and fabled institution. I have heard so much about this restaurant. I've heard legends, but I'd like to get it from the horse's mouth. Tell me all about Galatoire. Tell me about your illustrious history, and let's talk turtle soup too. We were founded in 1905 by Jean Galatoire. So here we are in 2016, yeah, wow. uh, 111 years later. The Galatoire family is still represented in the ownership and they're all the way into the fifth generation now. That's, that's which is, amazing. So let's talk about the turtle soup, because that's really why I'm here. Sure. I, was, I was told that it's one of the most iconic dishes sure. of the city, and nobody does it better than you for when I'm here. Well, thank you very much. So they took turtle, the American snapping turtle, mm -hmm. which in the swamps of Louisiana is in great abundance, and they began making this delicious soup of beef stock with the turtle meat that had been harvested, uh, you know, out of the swamps. A lot of people describe alligator as like chicken. Yeah. Is this more like duck? I would say it's a cross between that gaminess that duck has and chicken. It gets finished with hard-boiled egg, lemon zest, more parsley, and sherry. It's actually traditionally served with another side of sherry that hasn't been cooked off and you can add it if you choose. Oh, great. Oh, you and can just drink the sherry. A lot of people do. Imagine that. I'd like to have that option, actually. <laughs> you can leave the bottle, too. Yes. It's got a beautiful consistency. You can see that there's a, a real sheen on this, like a velvety sheen, very much like a gumbo. You know, all of the cooking down here really has sort of very technical French roots and then it's imbued with the local ingredients, so it's a fiery combination of often. All right, let's go in there. Mm. You can tell right away that it's beef. I mean, it's got those strong, deep, dark, roasted meat notes, but it's very right. There's layers of flavor up, you know, beyond that. You get some heat from the peppers, getting a really nice, and the texture of the, uh, of the turtle meat itself is like, it's really nice braised, so it's not it's not gritty at all. It's very tender, actually. And he's completely right about the flavor of this. It's, it's not like chicken. It's much more dark. It's got a gaminess to it, almost a brininess. But it's balanced really very nicely with the bold body of the actual soup itself. So it's a perfect soup. It's really finely ground, but it's not a puree. I mean, you're chewing on vegetables and turtle. And I think that they've rendered the turtle so, you know, they've braised it down so that it's really tender. I think it would be more difficult to do if it was like really big chunks, but that would be more of a stew. This is a real soup. They put cherry on this, which is, you know, kind of a classic French technique to cut a soup or something. And it, it, again, it really works well with the richness of the beef stock and the, and the earthiness and the brightness of the turtle soup. A little bit of sherry kind of cuts against that in the same way that lemon might, which they also put in here. So I think it tastes perfectly balanced, but I'm gonna add a little bit more sherry because, you know, who can get enough sherry in their life? Certainly not me. That actually works really nicely. Um, I thought it was very well balanced before, but adding the sherry really helped cut through that fat. It's good, but it doesn't need any more sherry. However, I do. Hopefully nobody saw that. Well, that was delicious. I highly encourage you to get down to Galatoire and try the turtle soup and also imbue yourself in this absolutely beautiful room. Click here now for more Micho. All together, our job here, we think, is like to try to mend Haiti and New Orleans kind of back together and show that there's a, like a bridge between the two.